Hello, this is Nico, and I noticed there are uh, quite a lot of questions about how to create an executable jar file. So, um, I would like to show you how to do this. And to do this, I took uh, one of the, the projects in my workspace, and um, the, here we see the, the main routine, which is in beta-e114.java. Now, if I run this program, then uh, I get this program where I can draw some shapes. Let's see, gray one, just for demonstration. Uh, I can draw them on the screen, and that's all this program does. So what I have uh, for this program is a bunch of Java files with the source code, and um, I compiled each of them. So there's also uh, so each of them is also in the bin directory. Now I go to MMI, which is the name of my project, and I choose export. Uh, you can also choose export in the file uh, menu, but I prefer to do it in the project. Um, then you select runnable jar file, and make sure, be sure do not confuse this with a uh, regular jar file. You need the runnable jar file. Um, obviously, then you click next, and here you have two options. Uh, the first option is uh, which Java file you want to select uh, as a starting point. And in my case, this is actually quite confusing. But here we go. Beta E114 of the project MMI. And um, here you can select uh, a location to store the jar file. And um, well, this seems pretty good to me. Let's have a look if I'm not, no, I'm not going to cheat on you. There's nothing in this directory yet. So we're going to create it. And we do that by clicking finish. And then we get a bunch of warnings. And that's because uh, all of my classes have a warning that they can be serialized and I didn't handle that. Um, so now we created a jar file, but well, no use of, uh, of doing that without testing it. So I'm going to close the clip. And then I'm going to double click the test file. And as you can see, I have all the functionalities that I used to have. They're still back in here. So that's how to create a runnable jar file. I hope it was useful for you. And, uh, well, have a nice day.